that is African culture. Whenever they achieve something, whenever they are happy, they usually sing and they usually dance. Since taking office, Chinese President Xi Jinping has visited Africa five times, each time receiving a warm welcome. People sang and danced to greet their distinguished guests from afar. Dance is an expression of emotion and a medium of cultural exchange. The ever-changing international stage has witnessed many remarkable moments of China and Africa dancing together in harmony. Over 50 years ago, African countries played a crucial role in helping restore the lawful seat of the People's Republic of China in the United Nations. Many UN representatives from African countries danced joyfully. It's also a very happy day for the world because we now have China as a member of the United Nations, which will change the dynamics of the world, which we are used to. When President Xi Jinping recalled this significant chapter, he expressed sincere appreciation to the many African friends who supported China back then. China will remain guided by the principle of sincerity, real results, amity and good faith, and take the right approach to friendship and interests. Together with its African friends, China will ensure that the spirit of China-Africa friendship and cooperation is passed down through generations and continues to flourish. We are happy about this uh, friendship between Africa and China, and we are seeing it consolidating and deepening over time. In May 2017, during the inauguration ceremony of the Mombasa Nairobi Railway, people joyfully danced traditional dances to celebrate the milestone of Kenya's largest infrastructure project in a century, which greatly promotes the well-being of the people. It signifies happiness, it signifies strength, and it signifies unity. So you see by the Chinese coming to Kenya through the Belt and Road Initiative, uh, coming to help us to build this infrastructure project, it signifies two things, social and economic development, which are very key in the development of the, both the Kenyan and the Chinese. So through this dance, it shows the unity that Kenya and China dancing to one tune. The Africa Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, the Foundioni Bridge in Senegal, the Nairobi Expressway, and a batch of other projects have been completed and handed over. China and Africa are joining hands in building a China-Africa community with a shared future in the new era. As you can recall, uh, in the Forum of 2021, His Excellency President Xi Jinping really emphasized on nine key areas that uh, need to be developed. Those included the areas of uh, terrain, uh, agriculture development, digital technology, and uh, also peace and security. So I believe in this forum, these uh, areas should be analyzed and uh, areas that need to be improved. On May 27, 2024, in Jinping County, Yunnan province, melodious songs resounded at the China Equatorial Guinea Friendship Primary School. The children talk via video link with Equatorial Guinea's President Teodoro Obiang Nguema Mabasogo and his wife, who were on a state visit to China. Nine years ago, President Xi and visiting President Obiang decided to elevate China-Equatorial Guinea relationship to an all-round partnership featuring equality, mutual trust and win-win cooperation. President Obiang pledged to build a school in Yunnan province. In 2016, local children sat in bright and spacious classrooms, and the muddy slopes were transformed into brand new playgrounds. Close cultural exchanges inject strong vitality and momentum into China-Africa cooperation in the new era. We 为中非命运共同体的未来做出贡献。